This is a fingerboard. And this is spray paint. So today, I'll be hydro dipping a fingerboard. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I hope you're excited today because today we are hydro dipping. If you are unfamiliar with hydro dipping, it's basically the process where you take spray paint or other paints and you have water. And what you do is you spray the spray paint on the water, different colors, and then you have this layer of spray paint on the water, and then you dip whatever you want into the water, and then you have the pattern on whatever you dip. So that's enough explaining for this video. So now let's do it. So this is the beautiful board that we'll be hydro dipping today. So first we need to mask it off with some black tape. So let's do that. So now we have our side that is completely masked off and then we have our side that is completely open. So now we get to hydro dip it. So the thing with hydro dipping is you either get a pattern that you really like or you really don't like. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna swirl this around and just start from scratch and then see if I get a better pattern. We hydro dipped paper towel. Mind blowing. All right, now time to try this again and see if we get a pattern that we really like. All right, that's looking really good. So let's go right here. All right, dropped it. <laughs> Yo, that looks really good. I'm just gonna see if I can dry up some of these water droplets without getting the paint. All right, that's looking pretty good right now. So let's now let it dry and then we can take the masking off. A few moments later. So we've now let the paint sit for about 10 minutes now and check out how cool this looks. I also dipped two little pieces of paper and these turned out really cool. I kind of did like a double dipping technique. I kind of went in and it stayed and then I pulled it out and then got like another layer. So this is like double layered, if that makes any sense. So these turned out pretty cool, even though there's not too much point in doing paper, but it's just cool. But now let's peel the masking off of the fingerboard. So I could have dipped this other side again, but I kind of like how it turned out like this. You kind of see that like white with like kind of just the beige color. And I honestly am really happy that I didn't dip it again because it kind of looks like an ocean now. You have like the waves coming up against the beach. And I really like how it did turn out. Something that's really cool about this graphic is because it's kind of paint, it's gonna really feel like real wear graphic. And that's basically a graphic that wears down and looks a lot like real skateboard graphic. So it's gonna be pretty interesting to see what this looks like once it's worn down a bit.
This is now completely complete, and I'm honestly super stoked with the results, especially with these gold trucks. It just gives it a super nice look. I am also really glad that I did the white and blue, and now it just has a cool look to it. Comment below if I should maybe do a giveaway on this at some point because honestly it's really cool and I would be happy for one of you to get this. But with that said, thanks for watching this video. All my social media links are down in the description down below. Make sure you're subscribed in case we're doing a giveaway soon. Two more videos down there and I will see you in my next video.